Hello everyone, GM Pariah here. Thanks for returning for this week's showcase of Tidewalker. Tidewalker is a melee caster hybrid great at chasing and controlling the map. Tidewalker's first ability is Ocean Blast. The move is a targetable range attack that damages and slows all enemies where it lands. Second is Surging Whirlpool. Tidewalker dashes in a straight line and damages all enemies he passes through. Third is Wave Attack. He has a 25% chance on hit to swing for extra damage at his enemies in front of him. Tidal Wave is his ultimate. A massive wave is summoned behind Tidewalker that damages and pushes any enemy in its path. Surging Whirlpool does decent damage, but its best component is the dash. I'm able to ambush two enemies and with help kill them. The capabilities of his dash are great. Even gaps like this one pose little problem to reaching a separated opponent. Here I'm able to run away with less than 100 HP from a nearly successful gank. I commit to a fight that I've already lost, and try to escape using Surgery and Whirlpool to dash away, but I pick a terrible place to do it. Dashing can give you that little boost you need to catch your enemy. I get a few swings in with the help of Wave Attack and slay my foe with Ocean Blast. Tidal Wave is all about timing and placement. Here's an example of good placement and timing, but poor judgment for continuing to chase. My opponent can dish out wicked damage, but because of when I use my ultimate, I not only do significant damage, I stop them from attacking long enough to give me the advantage. I bait my enemy into attacking me, and just as he runs away, I pull him back to my towers using my ultimate. Tidal Wave can assist in farming creeps as well. Not only can I use his ult to push enemies to my towers, I can use it to pull them away from theirs. I don't like the looks of my enemy's ultimate and I run for it. First I dash through the tree line, then use my own ultimate to stop them from chasing. Let's see that again from my enemy's perspective. As you can see here, the enemy has no chance of chasing me down because of my ultimate. His skills combo well. I use Tidal Wave to start my assault, then land Wave Attack. Finally, I use Surging Whirlpool to get in range for my Ocean Blast, preventing their escape. Thanks again for watching the Tidewalker Hero Showcase. Until next time, this is Pariah reminding you to check out the links below and visit us at areagames.com.